you know, I'd have a fiesta or something. I won't take the pork chops because there's really no point. A bow. Oh, let's see. Huh. So I didn't have to dig down, I just had to go down there. Could have told me to go whatever it was. Well, I built my awesome tower. Farming resources. Like bone meal from bones. Try instantly growing things. On what? We need a hoe. Oh, farmland. I think I'll just sit here and marvel at my wheat for a minute. And then just waste all the bone meal. And then chuck it off a cliff. Bye bye. That was really fun. Mm. Oh, using the pick I made earlier. And then take the coal. Plop it in the furnace, it makes charcoal! That's what's happening to the earth. That's what's happening to the earth. Which you can't. Yeah, you can. There was no need for that smiley face. Yeah, that's better. Charcoal, I got charcoal, I got charcoal, I got charcoal. Alternative lighting. Jack lanterns and glowstone are both useful light sources, but when working with water environments. You can use flint and steel to set fire to netherrack. It burns forever and provides light and defense. Trick monsters into walking through the fire. That's just horrible. Ah, oh, there is one of the most. Well, there are other signs. Here's Paul if you've accidentally with lava. It provides flowing light and it destroys enemies. Oh, lava. Put, dump lava into the hole. Ew, dump. Burn. Due to my text back, zombies are herobrin. Uh oh. No, no! That'll keep him off. Take a nap if you need to change the data. Sunlight is another useful source of light. Remember, disable people. Just break open caves and let the sun shine in. Burn! They all burnt. Shit. Never mind. I can get out easily. Um. Uh, 
And so, Stephen completed almost all of the course. Note when I said almost all of the course by cheating. <laughs> Long term food solutions. While pork chops are typically easy to get in a normal Minecraft map, it makes the game way too easy. Grass is very rare on my maps, and therefore so are farm animals. Don't expect an easy infinite supply of pork and leather to make free armor out of. If you have wood, water and spiders, you have food. Craft stick into string. Craft stick and a string into a fishing pole and go fish. I don't have stick or a string. I have sticks. Oh, and a string. But which direction? I really don't know how to make a pole. No, maybe it's two sticks. No. Diagonal. No. Why don't you like me? Okay, that's obviously not going to work. I suck at crafting. Mushrooms are great, but it'll take a while to start farming. Wheat is good if you're in a hurry, especially if you have some bone meal in it. So grow them. I've already done that, so I can't be asked. Okay. Whatever. I really just can't be asked with that bit. Water training. You can use items to create air pockets underwater. So, um. Signs displace water, creating air pockets to breathe in. So, do open doors and bench. or torches. Temporarily. Squids. I hate you, squids. Let's just try it with a torch then. I've never actually. Oh, so they do. That's cool. I left Mr. Torch behind. Never mind. Ah! Use water to climb up sheer cliffs. Repeatedly plant and reclaim water as you swim up the cliff face. Each time you put the water source block a bit higher, allowing you to swim up more and more. Plant water elevators. Swimming against the flow. No. God damn it, I fail at this. I barely got anywhere. Hell yes! Come on! I'll break this bad rock. I'll break this bad rock. Hell yes. Think this is what they meant. No, come on. Oh, I slightly failed there. I think I can make it. Yes, come on. Brilliant. Water is also great for safely lowering yourself. No, it isn't. <laughs> Steel. No, no, no! What am I doing? I can 
use the water to get myself back up. Yeah. What now? Have I reached the end? End of version 1.1. .1. New versions will have more training areas. Check back from time to time. Well, I guess I'll just walk then. <laughs>